can we picture God without saying, I don't think this God can do? Um, can we picture God and give him the glory without saying, I don't think he can do certain things? seen the hand of God, I've got a testimony and I know that most of the time we don't talk about things like this because we think it's well known stories. I had a very 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 difficult day yesterday going to church. My ear was saying you are not going to church, you cannot do church today, you cannot concentrate. But I said to myself, Hila is my God and I went to church by faith. I served the Lord. I did what God wanted me to do. I came back home. The ear was still painful, very, very painful. And I was a mom, like I did everything that a woman should do, come back from church, serve lunch and all that. Later in the day, we prayed with pastor. And as we were praying, I just felt the warmth of his hands on my ears. I just felt the healing power upon me. And at that moment, I just said, I am healed. I am healed. I am healed in the name of Jesus. I know we usually pray maybe for certain uh, things or whatever that might be going on at that time. But I felt the presence of the Lord immediately. And as we were done, I kept on saying, I am healed, I am healed. And I realized the power of speaking positive in the midst of it all. This morning I got the scripture. God was just confirming the joy that I have in my heart to say, healer he is to me. And I said to myself, I want to share it with someone who's saying, can he still heal? Um, or is there something extra that I, do, I need to do? No. The Bible in the book of Isaiah, chapter 46 Verse from verse 5 going down, it gives us the assurance of who God is. So reading it from the message translation, it says, Can you picture me without reducing me? Can we picture God without reducing him? Without saying, is he still capable? Without saying, can he still do it for me? Can we just see him as the healer? Today I just want to concentrate on the healing because I know that whatever God does for me, he actually has a word to someone who is out there thinking, do we still have him as a healer? He is a healer. He is a healer. I have seen him being a healer without me putting any effort, just me closing my eyes and believing the severe ear pain just went away, disappeared. I am here today healthy and fine because I believe in this God. And the Bible today is reminding me to say, can I not reduce him? When I look at him, can you picture me without reducing me? Oh my God. The Bible says, to whom will you compare me? The incomparable. God is amazing. God is faithful. God is God. God, oh my goodness, I don't even know how to say this because you know when you have seen something that God has done for you and you know and you're talking about this almighty God, the God in whom we trust, the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. And he doesn't want to be mixed with anything. No one can be compared to his power, his glory, his presence. He is a righteous God. He is a solid rock. He never changes. He's not a son of man that he should lie. He's that situation that you are in right now. Can you picture God without reducing him? Can you stand on the fact that healer he is to you? Healer he is to your situation. He is a faithful God. He is, take it from me. He is a faithful God. He doesn't need drama to heal you. In your quietness, in that space where you can just say, healer you are to me. He can be the healer right now. I am a witness. I'm testifying of his goodness. Jesus is the healer.